Hi, John here. Going to do a quick on packaging video. Got two little packages, uh, both from eBay. Uh, both arrived today while I was at work, so it's something good to open. Um, cost wise, I'm not 100% until I open it to see what they are, because they could be one of a few items I've ordered. Nicely secured in place, which is good. Now, I was speaking to somebody, I think it was Eric the Hoosin Nerd, about um, American football. His team is the Indiana Colts, I think. I got that right? And I said I can only. I know a few teams that I've seen um, on telly years and years ago, but when I was a youngster, I was aware of this team, um, and I was aware of this person who was. I think this is 1987, so I would have been seven years old the year he was playing, um, but I was aware of him and what his name was. And that is William Perry, who played with the Chicago Bears, defensive tackler. And he was also known as The Fridge. So that's a Topps Trump card from 1988. There's the back. Now I can remember that because I did have a Chicago Bear shirt and on the back it did say the fridge. Um, I think one of my relatives got it for me. It was um, the first time I'd ever had an American football shirt. Um, but yeah, I've actually been looking for an item, a card or something like that of him because he's the first American footballer I was aware of. Um, I think that cost me £2.99 for the card, and I think it was about a pound for shipping. No, probably less than that, it's probably about 60 70p for shipping. So, about £3.50 for 360 for that, including postage. So, I'm very happy with that because I was a fan of his at the time. Next item, a little package. Not 100% sure on what this is because, as I said, I've got a couple of items coming. Uh, yeah, so I know what this one is now. Um, I saw this and I was really interested in this because I've not seen anything like this before on sale. And it is horror related. And they are handmade by the seller who sells them on eBay. Just varying different designs on them. And on the one side you will see it is a normal 50 pence piece. But on the opposite side... Um, I'll just read a bit of the note that's with it um, it's got my address thank you for buying um, coming your way 100, 150th anniversary Beatrix Potter 50 pence piece which is that it should be a Peter Rabbit coin with Peter Rabbit shape on it 
But what this lady does, I think, yeah, what this lady does is she hand enamels them to give them a different style. Now, this has been done in a horror theme. I actually do quite like this because it does look really nice. I'll show you and see what you think first. It is, it is a horror from horror films. Um, they are three of the original films, and then there's been like a couple of newer additions to it. Some haven't been really good. The latest one does look quite interesting on the trailer, but if you can work it out, I can get it to zoom in. Right? Uh, wait, I have a few seconds to think. Now it's in a set of blue dungarees. It's in a multicolored stripe jumper. That is depicted as Chucky. So where the rabbit's face is, she's painted over it to make it look like Chucky and enameled it. And then that's been sealed. But I do really like that. Um, that cost me... I think it was £2... I think it was about two pound fifty, including postage. Um, so that I don't mind. I think it's quite a nice item, done by hand, enamel painted and then sealed over. So nice little item to have for the collection. <sighs> Got my fingerprints all over it now. Though. Like that, great little item. So that's two of the eBay purchases I've made. I've got others that are on the way. Um, got a couple that are coming from China, I think it is. So they'll be a couple of days to a week or two, depending on how quickly they come across. Um, and I've got a few other items that are on the way. But I just thought I'd share those. Um, if anyone, what I will do is, um, I'll see if there's an email on there. What I'll do is, I'll put a link from the person who does the money, and I will add that at the bottom so you can go and have a look at their eBay shop with all their different things and see if you're interested. Um, So yeah, you can have a look, they've got different things, um, I don't know if they ship internationally, um, but I'm sure you can have a look and find out, so I'll put the link down below for their eBay shop. Thank you for watching, I'll be back soon with another video, and bye for now.